welcome back to the channel the channel y'all today we work on this uh 2006 <laughs> bmw 325i we're gonna put on some uh catalytic converters on here so we're getting started I'm about to go in huh yeah that's a new part oh yeah She got no antifreeze in that either. Suck them, pop them off. See the locks, how you take them locks off though. You need to just push it back on there. Yeah. I just have to pull that lock up, guys, and just pull it off. Pull it up. Pull it up, boy. Now you gonna move this reservoir out the way those are size. What size is that? Nine, but I'm using 11. These are a size 10 millimeter, guys. Not 11. <laughs> no. Let's pop that lock off of there. Pop it up. Right there too. You got plug on the bottom. She got a little bit. She got a little bit. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Mm. There's also awesome manifolds on this side. Spray some of the glass on there for the rusty bolts. And I think those are size 10 too yeah, on, it, on the exhaust. Yeah, lady. You can, you can try. And we gotta move this cover up there, guys. These are size eight millimeter. Going across here, and I just dropped one. Oh, dang it! Got it. Put screws in there. Okay. <laughs> I was trying to um, think about on the other um three twenty. I can't remember what, what I had been on that one. Look at the filters under here too. She needs to replace her. They're dusty. Those are cabin air filters. You got a wire horn that's running on the bottom of it right there. Let me get these tabs right here. I thought we're gonna pull, the whole, pull that whole piece off of there. See it slide off. Huh? <laughs> there you go. Alright, you just put a lot in. You gotta see some. All right, guys, so you can see a lot better. About to start working over here on these bolts over here. We're just giving time to soak a little bit. Damn. You better hear that video get lost. And I'm off the phone. <laughs> Get it out of there. 
taking it is off. All right, guys. I took uh, some of the bo bolts off on the exhaust right here, right here, right here. I think we got eight bolts on each one, but now I'm about to take this uh, O2 sensor out right here. All right, guys. Got him! <laughs> You ain't gotta unplug it, people. See that? She's gonna need some. I'm gonna tell her that too. But yeah, that's like a real sweet baby. What a freaking. That's a, uh, and there's another one. That's another one. But another that, pipe. You know that shield gotta be moved. That shield. Or you can lift it up. Man, listen here. I'm taking these bolts out from the bottom of the uh, manifold. And um, they 15s. And with one of them, the one in the middle, right here, right here, huh? It ain't the one right there in the middle. You have to use a swivel with your 15 to get it. But I already broke three of them, and I'm taking the last one out. You did stop playing with your boy. Nah, I'm talking about mess with your boy and watch what I do. You feed me. Right, can I tell you? Can I tell you? Uh, we gotta get this bracket off because it's another O2 sensor right here. So it's a um, this bracket right here. It was two bolts on there and we took it off. Hold on, I'm gonna show y'all the bolt anyway so we can get this O2 sensor out of here. Two bolts of y'all. So they got a bad leak. One right here, one right here. And they was a size. Well, I used the size six millimeter, but they actually torqued um uh, bolts and nuts or whatever. So I just used the six and yeah, it'll fit on there. <laughs> so take that old two already broke off. <clears throat> Loosen it already. Quick. I don't like this turn. See here? Yeah. See that, and then you just sit it out your way because it got to go back on the new ones. But you need to replace them, you need to show up to them. Yeah. But just sit it out your way, it's right there. Okay, so I'm going to the bottom and break the other O2s. How it's got it's two at the bottom. Yeah, it's four O2 sensors and all. Of so keep the screw in order, you know where they go. You see that red? I don't know how to wash these for work. I tell you. Okay, I got, a, clear. I got a couple more. Um, how many did you get on this side? I took out, um, let me see. I see one right here. Because, you know, if you take this one out. I took out five If already. you take this one out, you know, you can pull one of them pipes out your way. Yeah, I took out five. So you got three more? Yeah, I got three more down here. On this is all some other phone. I'm going to try to show it to you. It's kind of hard down here. Y'all can see the ones that I took out. Oh, for them to see. These are some of the sweetest old things I've seen. They behave in the day. It's dark down there. So dark. Alright, guys, we're going to come back and we get this thing off. It's 16 of them. 16? Yeah, 16 manifold bolts. It's 8 on each pipe. And they are a size 11 on the exhaust manifold on the side of these over here. Size 11, guys. Uh, yeah. Okay. I had to remove this shield right here. I ain't got no light so y'all can't see me back. I had to remove these shields and the O2 sensor was literally plugged up and you just pull them out. You just pull them out and I also moved that to get more room to get more room down here to um pull them cats out 
So we about to get ready to pull them out. All right, baby, you can break it. Whatever you got to do. You need a screwdriver. Which one you want to pull out first? No, you got to loosen the other one up first. The Yeah, you got to pop it out of the... Okay, guys, we about to pop these uh, pipe off now. Just use a little pry bar right here. Stick it behind me. I already got it off. Trying not to mess up the gasket. Okay. That one right there loose. And this one is off. You see this one I can bring out first. Okay. So the best way guys to get it off is basically like jack the car up a little higher and pull them out through the bottom because like I said this AC line is in the way. So let me let y'all look. Hey, look at me. You see that Jack? Look down. She want to come on. Y'all can see that. <laughs> it's dark, guys, but you can see it. I've been putting in work since the 80s. <laughs> Alright, y'all, here go the old ones. Got them all. Whoo! Let's see. Oh, here. Oh, right here. Oh, right here. Let's know they burn. Right here. And right here. What is four, right? Oh. oh. Mm -hmm. One right here. <laughs> Get a little smoke break. Then she got to bring them over here, match them up, make sure they look good. <laughs> then she got the baby, like, like a chef. Yeah. So, yeah. Take it out of the yeah. <laughs> When I'm noticing on this one, babe, it don't have a bracket on it. Yeah, that was just like a, uh, right. a balancer. So the bracket don't have the bracket on these. And they don't got the studs in it. So they came with new screws, so. You got, I'm going to slide oh. them up back down through the top. Oh, yeah, it don't have the studs it's in here. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. It looks just like that, Shawk. Sure. Might left a little wild on them, but it's all good. They must have made it. Short body. All right, guys. Oh, yeah, that's good. Cool. They ain't got no choice. Oh, yeah. Unless you're going to sound like a truck out here. Oh, well, they all actually designed like that. Look at this. This one. And the same thing. All right. And that piece right there that you were telling me about, that bracket, mm -hmm. that one was holding me. It was hitting on this right here. On the mountain. So it went. Let me yeah. slide her. So, yeah. No, it, it, we don't, we don't go back down. <laughs> yeah, it came with new gaskets and new bolts. We're going to run it back down ah, to the top. So It's heavy. Since it don't have that bracket on it, we definitely. And they loose. So, we dig on. Don't forget to put y'all gaskets on. Put one in on the hole. It. Mm -hmm. 
And then we only put one to hold it. And that's one. Right there. Yeah, that's it on, guys. So I'm about to send the other one through the roof. And uh, we're going to get it out of the mud like that. Baby, I'm going to put the gas in um, Do you want to put the ultra sis in it on the bottom? Yeah, I might do. Which one that one is? It's down there. You left it down there. All right, he's going to go down there and put the ultra sis on guys. We're gonna bring the oven up from the bottom. So we we putting one through the top. This first one put down through the top. Cause see that bracket was getting hung up on this motor mount right here when we was trying to put it out the old one out from the uh, top. <clears throat> That's why we had to jack the car up some and pull it out through the bottom because of that bracket. Look at the other screw that I told you. Went up, guys. Okay, okay, hold, hold it right there. Let me get one on this, uh, one screw on. Okay. You got your gasket between the... All right, guys. Put these all these nuts back on here, tighten it up, and we'll be back. Ah. All right, now, people, y'all see, we put new bolts in there, new pipe, new gasket, all look sealed and delivered. Now, and then we put the old two sensors back in. Let me get on up under here. Most likely, but I want y'all to see everything has been put back the way it need to be. Everything bolted and spoted, sealed. Everything good. You know what I'm saying? Okay. All right, guys. We got it all back together. Show y'all right quick, cause I'm sorry y'all couldn't get y'all that good good footage, cause it was like so um tight over here, and I couldn't get my camera down here like I needed to get. So. Yeah, I know. Yeah. 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 